Hey guys, it's Nita Patel. If you're new to my channel, please don't forget to subscribe and like my videos as well too. And leave a comment below if you're interested in learning anything about real estate as well as um, any, any topics and interests that you have, right? All right, so let me go straight right into the video. As you can tell, I'm wearing red. We are gonna talk about red doors and I'm having a hard time saying red doors because I'm gonna be saying it so many times. Um, but you know, we're gonna talk about why in many cultures uh, they paint their door red. I will tell you why I painted my door red because I like feng shui. I like, you know, having attracting positive energy to me, um, attracting good luck to me. I like to navigate my energy that comes into my uh, my house. As you can tell, I'm wearing red bangles, red bindi, red lipstick because I. It also gives me that power. It also feels feels good when I wear red, right? We always, you know, that song in Lady in Red, right? Um, the Red Door by Elizabeth Arvin, I think that's her last name. Don't quote me, I think, yeah, that, the perfume. Um, so just the Red Door itself, so in many different culture has a lot of different meanings and I'm gonna try to bring you a couple of them just to give you some idea uh, what is actually why some cultures have their door red, uh, painted red door. In American culture, a long time ago in our tradition, we used to paint the door red. They used to paint red was because they wanted any travelers that were traveling, wanted them to know that this is a safe heaven for them, that they can come here, take a rest, they can get meal, they can relax, they can, you know, um, stay over for the night. That's what the red door was actually for at that time. And as the Civil War, like during the Civil War, like the Underground uh, Railroad, uh, when, when, you know, with slavery and things like that, that was also used to let them know as two African-American slaves, so let them know that they're protected here. If they decide to come and take shelter here, they will be protected. That was in our American culture. All right, let's move on. Uh, the second culture that we're going to talk about is the Irish culture. In Ireland, why people went and painted their door red. They painted their uh, door red to, to scare off any evils, any, any evil spirits coming to them. So there's some common threads, right? Um, they're just basically, you know, they didn't want any evil uh, spirits coming into their door, okay? So that's why some of them painted their door red. All right, the second one is uh, in Scotland. Why did they paint their door red? In Scotland, the reason that they painted their uh, door red was to let them everybody know that they've actually paid off their mortgage and i thought that was pretty good being in a real estate and being able to advertise that you've actually paid off your mortgage that's pretty good right so they painted their uh, door red because that was the reason that they decided i mean that was their culture that to show everybody that hey we're debt free our house is paid for it belongs to us in the Chinese culture, which Feng Shui also falls under, um, they we they painted the door red. Same thing that I said about Feng Shui was that is to attract good luck, is to attract positive energy, the positive flow, um, well-being. So that's why they painted the door red as well. Uh, those are some of the some of the you know cultures uh, that painted their door red. Red itself, color itself, it's a very strong color, and um, I should probably do another video on that why certain colors um, you know uh, does what. But red is one color throughout the whole life, um, throughout the whole culture. It doesn't matter what culture you follow, uh, it's very common. Red water those are very too common uh, in many religion as well in many different cultures as well too but today i'm just going to talk about the red door right all right um so with that being said uh that's it that's that's all i had for you actually but red door nowadays you know if you're driving around you're going to see a lot of red doors some of them don't even know what it means but it really does if you're doing something and if you just got a new house or new place you want to do something do a red door no doubt like it would have it would add a such a nice carb appeal to your place it would just make it pop it will make it really really pop as you can tell i have green siding so it's definitely making it pop you know any any time that i've decided to change anything my red door just stays red does not matter the two houses in augusta georgia i had i always made sure my house my house uh, the red door was always that my front door was always red um so that's just to attract good good energy 
And so, but nowadays, you know, we see yellow, blue, uh, different shades of orange doors out there too, you know, uh, just to add a really nice carve appeal and it definitely stands out, right? If you don't blend in, and especially if you have white siding in the back and then black, you know, shelter, I mean, shutters, and then you have a red door, classic like you can't go wrong red just attracts that's that's it so definitely um if you need a a quick touch up and you want to do something different definitely give this one a try and see what you feel and um, if you want to learn more um, I definitely suggest you type it up in Google about red doors and because even in Feng Shui they have a particular doors uh, you know depending on the which way your house is facing again and if you miss my video on you know the east facing um, that's I'm gonna link it right above here so definitely check that video out as well too but um, also but yeah but definitely check it out and do some research on it because this is exactly it's good why not you want to know more right all right that's all i had for you today hopefully you liked my video uh definitely leave a comment below and also as always let me know what you guys are interested in uh, for me to do other different topics and um this is nika patel over and up